So the most awesome part of Inkscape, especially after working so hard in the GIMP, is how easy it is to add text. Step number one, click text, type in, this is text not yet on a path. Step number two, I want to put that text onto a path. Yep, it's true. So I'll just make a nice curve here, wrap it back around, press enter. So there's my path, there's my text. I highlight both of them, or if you want, you can click on one of them, hold down shift and click on the other one. Now they're both highlighted. And I go to uh, my text and I say, put on path. Done. Then I go to my text and I can do anything I want. So I can highlight my text and make it really, really big. And I can change the color of it. And I can change all kinds of different spacing options. Oh, which one is this? Spacing between letters, that's what I want. Let's click on that and see how we do. Oh, it's getting bigger. It's kind of a little bit glitchy at this point, but let's have a look. Yep, I'll just keep spacing it out. All right, now, if I want to go and edit the point on this path, okay, so now, put it way over here. It doesn't know what to do. It's sort of all messed up. I can swing this back around, try something else. And you can see that as I go along, I'm just going to click that point and press delete for right now. So as I go along with this, it's actually deleting letters as I go, or I can pull them all out, or I can even pull them out even more. Okay, and I can also continue drawing my Bezier curve. And when I press enter, it just makes a new curve and puts it all on. You can also do the same thing with a circle, although circles are just not very interesting. Uh, oops, let's try that again. So there's a circle. <clears throat> there's, oh, sorry, let's try this again. Circle. Oh, of course, it's going to do this to me. All right, there we go. We'll make the circle go all the way around. Okay, and I can also wrap my text to that. So we'll just quickly make some text. Text around a circle. There it is. There it is. Text. Put on path. Done. Now the problem is that it's going from this point here. So I'll just bring this point around and try to bring this point around. There we go. And then I'll bring this point around again. So there you go. Text on a path. So easy and done.